welcome to a new vlog. So on today's vlog, we are doing something very special for uh, AO Academy. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Aryan Oyun, and I'm the founder of AO Academy, where we help people design their meaningful lives. And one of our core programs is called our Gap Year program. And that is uh, a program dedicated specifically for our Gap Year students. And within the curriculum, we have, we have them uh, doing internships in their interested fields or interested majors. And today is the day where we are going to partner up our GAP students officially with uh, their interning companies. We are on our way to officially partner our first group of students. So today will be a busy day. So let's just uh, get this video started. And yeah, I have my iced coffee here. And yeah, I'll take you guys along with my journey. And I'm really excited because we've worked so hard for this. Like uh, we've been planning a gap year program since the day we launched everything, right, Ayuka? Yeah. Like it's been, it's gonna be our one year anniversary. I mean, it's already been our one year anniversary. So we've been talking about a really good quality gap year program that really, really just helps the students in all aspects of their needs since the beginning of our founding date. So to see this happening, to about to see this happen, I'm very excited. And I'm very proud of my team. Uh, yeah, they did internship Oh my god! Hi! Hi! Yeah! Hi! 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 So we successfully onboarded our first group of students to Air Market and as you guys have seen on the vlog, Air Market is one of the top um, pioneering companies in the travel, tourism and ticketing agency business. So we're so excited that our students will get lots of exposure and yeah, off to the next company. second group of students who will be interning at Art, 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 Art. <laughs> so yeah it's gonna be on the 17th floor of Central Tower and so yeah we're gonna drop off our second group of students here I'm very excited Yeah. 
Officially done. So excited! We just finished uh, onboarding our GAP students to Art ARD, and uh, it was interesting because uh, it was such a different environment. You know, it was a more corporate vibe with uh, you know lots of financial uh, products, and uh, I think it was interesting because our students will get like a really good exposure into how big companies work. So yeah, it was a great day one successful execution now tomorrow we will be uh, we'll be onboarding our students to um, two other companies which also have such different vibes as well so yeah Yay. All right, uh, how to balance your life 101 you go to a corporate meeting and then you also go to Sarosa afterwards <laughs> to get your meat and today I am in charge usually uh, my husband and I we rotate weekly for our groceries because uh -huh. like most of the times we can't go together so today is my turn to get some our monthly meat supply so let's go <laughs> oh my god I had this idea we should do ceramic art with our GAP students. Oh, sure. Right? Wow. These are so cute. This would be like really good um, housewarming mm -hmm. presents. Mm -hmm. okay. First stop is beef. So we're gonna get beef from her. Mongolia there's a thing where we kind of buy our meat from our guy or our our lady our usual so yeah uh, these are the usual people that we get our meat from I guess in the States like you don't really see the butchers mm -hmm. in the supermarket right they're usually like already cut and prepared and it's like sold already like priced and stuff in Mongolia we just like look at lots of meat and then we pick and choose and then it's weighed it's like chopped it's like catered to your needs and then it's sold
There's a little thing I do at the end to reward myself for getting groceries is getting my new phone case and new nut from this little corner. So if you guys ever go to Sarasa, there's this corner um, that has all the phone supplies and like they change the cover and like everything. So screen protector recommended. That's not much of water. That's not much of Wow. Oh, yeah. All right, grocery done done. Three to the third, done done. The case done done. Now got the key. Oh, so get in the car. Wherever you are, get inside. Hi, Leia. Today's first day of kindergarten, baby. Yeah? Are you excited? Leia. <laughs> Minyaka unutter it still the ochash delay, Michino. Eh? Oi, Michino, chee. Eh? Alright, so we are going to the kindergarten right now, and um, there's supposed to be something happening from, for the Nifte Echtra, like the opening ceremony. So we're gonna see what that is all about. But yeah, I can't believe the first day of kindergarten is here, you guys. You guys have been following me. I'm sure it feels the same. I'm sure it feels like Leia just gave birth. No, I just gave birth to Leia and you guys were watching her, uh, you know, birth vlog and her just, you know, being a toddler, you know, being a newborn, then a toddler. But um, I guess the time is here for Leia to go to kindergarten. <laughs> so yeah, um, Toro and I are here both together. We're gonna drop her off and We'll see if she cries. I hope she doesn't cry that much. Playing around with lots of stuff, climbing and jumping everywhere. Actually, one of the main reasons why I decided to give Leia to kindergarten at two years old is because she is such a social kid. She loves to play around. She <laughs> she doesn't like to stay at home, honestly. And She really likes to play around with kids and she's such a social kid so as a family we thought it would be a good decision for her to go to kindergarten instead of just staying at home all day uh, you know with her nanny and especially when it gets cold outside in the area, kids don't really play outside because it's too cold and it's also very blue. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Okay, so we just dropped off Leia at her kindergarten and I think we stayed, I think we overstayed our stay. So this is a um, tip coming from a new new parent who just dropped off her kid at the KG. So don't stay for too long because I think we stayed for about 20 minutes just hanging out, playing with her. And we should have just left as soon as she got, you know, um, distracted by all the toys and all the, you know, things going on there. So. Yeah, she cried a little bit, um, but the teachers were so nice and I hope um, they're gonna take care of her. They ended up giving her uh, stickers, which is Leia's current favorite toy. So yeah, they were kind of left like that. And, and I was just telling my husband in the car, like I'm so proud of each other. I'm so proud of you and I'm so proud of me as a mother that, you know, this is a huge milestone for us, you know, going through two years of having a young, having a kid was really really tough and I'm sure this goes to all the mothers and fathers out there so yeah this is a huge milestone for us and I'm very proud of ourselves as parents and as a family.